Hi, it's Chester at Blue Peak and Computer Training. And in this video, we're going to look at how to recover an Excel file that's never been saved, and also how to recover a previous version of an Excel file. Let's start with how to recover an Excel workbook that's never been saved. So this workbook here, loads of data in, I never got around to saving it, and for some reason I've closed it without saving. So how do I get that data back? Well, I go to File, Open, go down to Recover Unsaved Workbooks, and there is your workbook. Click on Open. It says up here that this is a recover file that is temporarily stored on your computer, so eventually it will be deleted. So what you need to do is do a Save As, decide where you're going to save the file, give it a name, and then it's saved. Now, let me just show you some settings in Excel that affect that functionality. If we go to File, Options, Save. There's an option here, Save Auto Recovery Information every X number of minutes. And by default, that will be 10 minutes. But you can change it to a different number of minutes if you so desire. And also you've got this option here, Keep the Last Auto Recovered Version if I close without saving. So you need to make sure that that remains ticked. And what happens is that the last temporary file that it creates up here, auto recovery version, is kept if you close the file without saving. And this is the location where it saves those files. Click on OK. Second scenario is where you have a file that you have previously saved, but for whatever reason, you may have deleted a whole load of data, for example, saved it and you want to get back to a previous version of the file. Now, the way to do this is to go to File, Info, and then you'll see in the version sections here, you'll have the auto-saved versions of this file. Previously, Excel created an auto-saved version. If I click on it there, you can see that I now have all the data in my file. And what I can do here is click on Restore, Click on OK here, and it's overwritten the previously saved version with the version that I can see on the screen. Now, if you have saved your workbook on the OneDrive in Excel 365, the process is slightly different. So let's open up the file in Excel 365. So I'm in Excel 365, and this file is saved on the OneDrive. Auto saved is turned on. What I'm gonna do is delete a whole load of data. The file gets automatically saved, and I want to return to a previous version. So what I do is I go to File, Info, Version History, which opens up this task pane on the right of my screen. And here I can see previous versions of the document as saved on OneDrive. And what I can do is just click on the last saved version, and then I can restore. And now I have all the data in my file again. Okay, that's all I wanted to cover in this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please subscribe and I'll see you next video.